public service announcements. So, eh, there was someone that was sharing something with me. He was trying to ask, or should I say he was asking, a way of getting out of debt faster. Hmm. It's actually a tough one. Getting out of debt faster in this present economy. <laughs> we like say things not very rich. Ah. To even address this topic, self is actually very difficult for me because uh, the cost of living now, not the affair they live in. And, uh, but it will, it will, we must always find a way to, to skate through this thing. To me, oh, So to me, one of the ways at which someone can get out of debt faster is what? First of all, why you borrow? That question first, you need to ask yourself, why you borrow? Why you borrow it, you borrow? What's your essence of borrowing? Was it really called for? Was it something you can do without? Hmm? Now, if you, have, if you sit down, analyze this thing, check very well. I don't know if you understand. Okay, if I don't want to borrow, what's the other way out of this thing? Is there a way I can, I can skip through without having to borrow? I don't know. So after getting these facts, you should be able to place yourself. First thing first, learn not to. Learn not to, I'm not joking on. Except... You are triple sure. I'm not even saying double sure because double sure can, might not be even be sure. So be triple sure that uh, borrowing there is always there is always a way to pay back. So if you are if you are triple sure that there is a way to pay back, then uh, there is no there is no excuse of you listening to me because uh, the truth is not far fetched. After borrowing, it can be able to turn over for you, and you can be able to do something very meaningful to it. To whatsoever you are borrowing for, the cost at which you are borrowing for. Now, another thing is being consistent. Being what? Being very consistent. Let's say, for example, uh, you borrow for someone. Okay, uh, I borrowed 100,000 from this person. I'll not forget this money. If you tell yourself, say, okay, you know what? Uh, now, for 5,000, I want to pay every month. Learn to keep to it. Keep to it. Keep to it. If it's the 5,000, learn to keep to it. No matter what, try and caution yourself. Try and train yourself. Try and work on yourself. So that you'll be able to what? Keep to this, to these principles of, okay, you know what? Be committed to it. Embrace it. Paying debt is not really, is not rosy. It's not rosy at all because if you think about it this way, the person you borrow for or the establishment you borrow for had to fulfill something in order to give you that funds for you to be able to do what you needed to do with the money. So it wasn't rosy for them giving you. Why should it be rosy for you paying back? Why? So if you get that fact into your head that, okay, being consistent no matter what, I believe you, should, you can be able to skate through. Seriously, you can be able to skate through. Mm -hmm. Eh? But to me, oh, to me, borrowing is not something I really advise. It's not something I really advise. So take your time, look around, do what you need to do. Then see what comes out of it. Before you think of borrowing, borrowing should be the last option for you, no matter what. It should always, always be the last option. Well, I know, or even the ones I have said, self, you will still go back and go do it in your mind. But I have said my own. They said the world is enough for the wise. You who has here, let them what? Thank you guys. And I'll see you in the next video.